Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. I know it has been a minute since uh, uh, we have taken this journey. Oh my God, on this morning, uh, our spiritual uh, journey fit for the kingdom. But I'm really, really, really blessed on this morning and wanted to spend some time uh, walking and encouraging and uh, just letting you know how faithful uh, God is. May it be an encouragement um, to you on this morning. Hello, somebody. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, I know it's been a minute since I've been out here, you know, in my favorite place of walking, you know, in this in this intimate place that I like to walk in. Uh, and, and, you know, where we just kind of just fellowship and commune a little bit on this morning. So I'm excited this morning about the Father uh, and who he is in our life. And, you know, it take me uh, a little minute, you know, I have to kind of warm up a little bit uh, before I get off into uh, this, this, this talk, this inspirational encouragement on this morning. But I'm determined, listen, I don't know about you family, I love you guys, but I'm determined to get through this walk on this morning with the Lord's help. May I bless you on this morning and tell you how much that the Father loves you and how much uh, he loves us and how much uh, he adores us and that we have purpose and we have purpose uh, in the Father and we will not allow any situation or circumstance in our life to get us out of purpose. Who am I talking to on this morning? So I want to start out by just encouraging you. What is our scripture today? It was the one that I was praying on my way to work this morning. And it goes a little something like this in Psalms 51 where it says, create in me a clean heart. Oh God, and renew in me a right spirit. Are you hearing me? Because this is a time for us uh, to get in our proper place and alignment with the Father purifying us and cleansing us. Are you hearing me? If we're going to do anything in the kingdom that glorifies our Father, He has to do something on the inside of us. And it start with this thing uh, dealing with our heart. Now we know that in the medical field, are you hearing what I'm saying? The heart surgeon, are you hearing me, deals with all the entities of our hearts, you know, our valves. Are you hearing me? Uh, it deals with our heart. And so if anything that is malfunctioning in our heart, the, the, the chief cardiologist will go in there and do surgery. Well, I want to talk to a few folks on this morning. Uh, we have the chief physician, which is Dr. Jesus. Are you hearing me on the scene? And so what we want him to do is purify our hearts on this morning. I know this may not be popular to some because we don't want the Father to purify our hearts. What do I mean? We want our, we, our hearts cannot be tainted with. Our hearts cannot be unclean, unpure. Are you hearing me? As a matter of fact, I speak spirit cannot be foul. Are you hearing me? Uh, uh, who am I talking to on this morning in this fit for the kingdom inspiration? Can I tell you this morning, if you want the Lord to move in your life, uh, if you want the Lord to do something in your life, uh, if you want the Lord to download in your spirit, uh, you got to come in alignment. Who am I talking to uh, with the will of the Father? You got to tell the Father, purify Purify me, uh, purge me with hyssop, cleanse me, uh, make me clean again, uh, make me whole again. Uh, who am, oh, you think I'm just talking to you? Uh, no, I'm not.
not just talking to you. Uh, I tell the Father on a daily basis, uh, purify me, uh, cleanse me. Are you hearing me? Uh, don't let nothing be in my heart, oh God. Uh, that's not of you that will get in the way uh, of my kingdom assignment. Uh, who am I talking to on today? Don't you allow nothing uh, to get in your heart, uh, get in your spirit, man, that will cause detox in your spirit. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, you are no use in the kingdom uh, if your spirit is foul, uh, if your spirit is jacked up. Uh, you are no use in the kingdom, and neither am I. Uh, who am I talking to on this morning? Can I talk to you? Now let me tell you something. I like David. Oh Lord have mercy. Because David wasn't always good. David made some mistakes. Who am I talking to? Are there any Davids out there? You are anointed by the Father. You are chosen by the Father, but your heart right now is out of alignment with the Father. So I want to talk to a few Davids. See, David had sense enough to know I am out of the will of the Father. And I need to get back in alignment with the Father so that I can complete the task, which is your kingdom assignment. That the Father has before me. Let me tell you something. There is life and there is death. Uh, what are you doing in between the dash? Ah, uh, Lord, have mercy. Uh, what are we doing in between the dash uh, that shows the Father that we are a vessel that he will not regret choosing? Uh, am I talking to somebody? Y'all know Saul. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, the Father regretted even anointing a uh, Saul king. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, would that be you? Or would that be me? I don't know about y'all, but I've been through too much hell. Rock out of the Bohosiah to be denied the fact of the Father using me. Don't make me run out here. Roboko Sataya. Ribandidiaseke. Who am I talking to on this morning? Mandeliboko Can I talk to a few folks who want to be real about their kingdom assignment? I'm not talking about the counterfeit. Oh, come on, Shataya. I'm talking about the one that said, Father, clean me. Father, purify me. Father, restore me. Father, here I am. Do what you want to do with me. Ah, oh, that's the person that I'm talking to. Ah, uh, oh, Lord have mercy. Uh, don't be a counterfeit uh, to your kingdom assignment. Uh, what am I saying? Uh, you do the acts. Uh, we do the acts. Uh, but our heart is so far from the Father. Mm. I know that there's a scripture that talks about the depart from me. Uh, you are workers of iniquity. Uh, 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 Lord, who am I talking to? Uh, do you want the Father to tell you that all the work that you've done uh, depart from me because uh, you did it in the flesh realm, uh, not in the spirit realm, uh, not of my spirit, uh, but another spirit. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, let me talk about something else. Uh, we better be careful. Rabakatanobokosaya, operating in the spirit of divination, uh, turning these magical tricks. Uh, Rabakatanobokosaya, trying to make it look like we're doing something that's not ordained by God. Go sit down and be purified. <laughs> that go for me, you and everybody. I'm not exempt from this here. No, I am not. I have to align myself with the will of the Father. Who am I talking to? Oh, Bashoka. 
Oh, don't make me run out here. You probably say, why is she hollering? I'm going to say it low so you can comprehend. Get your house in order. I kind of about Kosaya. I kind of about Kosaya. Because this is the time. Are you hearing me? That the Father Himself is going to expose us. Get your house in order. Oh, I say. Robata la basianda, imande lebo kosa. Can I talk to you? Uh, just a few more minutes. Uh, thank you, Holy Ghost, for this walk. Uh, thank you, Father, for breathing the breath of life. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, can I tell you something? What I like about the scripture. Of Psalm 51. See, David recognized uh, that he needed the Father. Uh, there was no pride in the way. Uh, he humbled himself. Uh, we better get that prideful spirit out the way and let the Father deal with us uh, so that we can be the vessels, uh, vessels of honor uh, that he can use. Uh, if our hearts ain't pure and our hands ain't clean, we are spitting our toxic things into the body of Christ. Go sit down, all of us. Hoba sheke, manda labo hosata, menda le labo hosita, labo sarati le usuga, mishende teke basa. Who am I talking to? Uh, Lord have mercy. Uh, let me slow this thing down just a little bit, uh, cause I want to talk to a few folks uh, who understand the value uh, of the anointing, uh, the price that we have to pay for the oil. Uh, there is a crushing. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, there is a crushing uh, for this oil. Uh, the olive oil had was first of olive. Uh, it had to be crushed. Uh, oh, basheke kabasete. Uh, that means some things had to happen uh, to get the oil into its purity. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, let's go back to the scripture. There are some things in your life uh, that has to be crushed. Uh, oh, Lord, have mercy. Uh, you want the oil to drip from heaven. You better align yourself with the will of the Father. I better align myself with the will of the Father. Obakosa. Ah, Lord, have mercy. He bought a labo hosheke. Mende lebo hosema, yes, I. A soca yabasita. Robot a labo quianda. Oh, who am I talking to uh, on this morning? Uh, those of us, uh, the Bible, the Bible says, uh, those that hunger and thirst after righteousness uh, shall be filled. Uh, can I ask you something? Uh, are you hungry? Uh, are you thirsty? for his righteousness so that you may be filled with his spirit okoshi Ratala boho ma yena na bakaso ribandeli asendeli di aseke oh my lata la baseke i feel like serenading the father i mandele sheke roso kaya saro seke ribandeli ase Lord, have mercy. Uh, this thing is good to me, y'all. Oh, my shake it out of the Roma show. Let me tell you something. Uh, you better love on daddy for real. Uh, you better love on people for real. Uh, who am I talking to? Uh, Oh, Bashende de de Listen, listen, listen. I don't know about you, but I am so, oh, in love with the Father. I am so fired up about the call that is upon my life. I don't take it for granted. I'm so humbled that the Father would choose somebody like me. So undeserving, but yet He say I'm worthy. I know that I'm not the only one. We're so undeserving, but yet He makes us worthy. Why? Because we are yielding over to the Father. Ah, for real. Uh, this ain't no time for no mamby pamby stuff. Uh, this is time to get in, in, in alignment uh, with the Father for real. Oh, bashelele seke, rabatara la basianda. Woo! Lord have mercy. Listen, listen, listen. Oh, Lord have mercy. Ah, I'm just. 
I'm just high in the Father. Oh, Lord, have mercy. I'm high in the Father. Are you hearing me? Let me tell you something. Uh, there's no amount of drugs uh, that can get you this kind of high. Because, see, this kind of high you don't come down from. Uh, oh, Lord, have mercy. Uh, when you are in tune with Daddy, uh, this kind of high, baby, you don't come down from. Because uh, it's still be burning in your spirit uh, you are still lit on the inside and then what happens it manifests on the outside uh, your purpose should manifest on the outside because you have allowed the father to purify you and cleanse you on the inside ah oh, lord have mercy so listen that's our fit for the kingdom, uh, our inspirational walk for today. I feel pretty good. Y'all know I love this place. I love to hang out here. I said, wait a minute, Father. You want me to go hang out in my place this morning that you gave me to hang out in to do my walk. Uh, so I just I just came on out here in obedience. Uh, I don't know who it's for. I'm not your hype man, but I am the one that God has sent. He has put a word in my mind. Mouth, and I'm going to speak truth. Are you hearing me? The reason why I'm going to speak his truth and not my truth, because his truth transforms life. His truth brings deliverance uh, even to me. Lord, have mercy. So if you want to be kept by the Father, allow the Father to purify you. Allow the Father to cleanse you. Are you hearing me? You want a clean heart and you want clean hands. Listen, I love your family. Oh, it has been a wonderful walk on today. It has been a glory. Listen, the wind is blowing out here. It has been a wonderful walk on this morning. Let me tell you something. The Father is more than able to keep us. He don't force himself on us. But guess what? We need to try to force ourselves his way and say, Father, it is I. Whatever you want to do with me and through me. That brings glory to your name and that lives are transformed because I am totally submitted to your will for my life. My heart is pure and my hands are clean. Are you hearing me? We can't lay hands on the sick and they recover and our spirit is foul. We are transferring spirits. Are you hearing me? Are you hearing me? Now is time. For us to we are in the end times. I don't know who, who didn't tell y'all we are in the end times. We are in the last days. We don't have no time to play games. We can't play Russian roulette. Are you hearing me? What our kingdom assignment, period, point blank. We don't have time to play Russian roulette with our kingdom assignment. Are you hearing me? So can I tell you something? Uh, you know, T.D. Jake should say, get ready, get ready. I want to say, are you ready? Are you ready? Not get ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? T.D. Jakes, I love him. He say, get ready, get ready, get ready. Are you hearing me? But the time now that we're in is, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? So listen, this your sis. Hallelujah. I love y'all. Blessings. Oh, my God. I love y'all. With everything that's in me, listen, the God in me is telling you to really walk in your kingdom purpose for real. Are you ready? The harvest is ripe, but the labors are few. And those of us who are laboring need to labor with a clean heart, clean hands. We need to be pure. Amen. Amen. So I love you guys. Blessings, blessings, blessings on this morning. Hello, 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 hello. I got to go. Y'all know me. Once the Father releases, I don't try to add nothing. I don't try to take nothing away. I just give it like he give it to me. And when the Father is through, I'm through. But on a note as your sister, this is me talking. <clears throat> to you, to encourage you, 
to be found doing everything that the Father has told you to do. Do it with a pure heart, with clean hands, with pure motives, because there are lives out there that has to be changed because we showed up and executed the assignment that God gave us from a pure place. He wants pure vessels. That's us. I love you as well. He wants pure vessels. So if you don't hear nothing else, I'm going to say it as your sister. Get your house in order and proper alignment with the Father. And that includes me too. I'm not exempt at all. I'm not talking at you. I'm talking to you and I'm talking with you. Why? Because this applies to me too. We can get tax, tax exemptions, but we can't get no spiritual exemption pass to not be purified in our assignment. All right? So I love you guys. Blessings, blessings. May y'all have a blessed day, a blessed weekend. My, 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 my. I love you guys to like. And if y'all not doing anything, join me. Uh, hopefully the weather permits me to get to the radio station on tonight. I love you guys. Bye-bye. Thank you, sis. Thank you. Thank you. I love y'all. I got to go. Bye-bye.